So yesterday I attended a really great event. It was a Harwell campus women's networking breakfast event, which marked International Women's Day and brought together people from our all levels of their careers and all different industries across the campus themselves to have a bit of a, a conversation around the importance of International Women's Day and career development. I think networking is one of those words, it's sort of a, a misleading word, a bit of a, a bad choice, because actually networking is, sure, days like this, events like this, where we've come together as Diamond to meet, or days like yesterday where we were speaking to people across campus, but also networking can be a lot of softer things. It's, it's really all about an opportunity for connection. And connection looks different depending on, on where you're at in your career or depending on who you are, but all of the leaders that we spoke to throughout the networking events all touched on the importance of fostering connection, whether that's getting a coffee with a friend to talk about how their path has gone, really actively listening and making those mental connections between where you're at, or if it's following someone inspiring on LinkedIn and sharing parts of their journey that are relevant to you and your community. It can be a really interesting way of, of mapping where you are with the sphere that you're sitting in. And it's, it's very human and personal. I think it's really, really vital that we mark days like this, days like International Women's Day, because we know that representation in STEM and in science is, is lower than it should be. I mean, even at Diamond, we only have 23% um, female staff, which is absolutely something that we should be talking about and addressing. I feel really proud of, of steps that Diamond are already taking to, to support a career for, for women here that feels fulfilling, it feels safe and has a, has a culture of growth so you can work somewhere and really love where you're working and who you're able to be at work. There are networks like the Gender Inclusion Network, which are bringing modern conversations to the fore, forums and events which are really encouraging. And I know that there's plans already to start really two-way conversation communities between women who work here every day and leadership to really enact change. So that's, that's a really positive place to be in. But I think, you know, when we're talking about what more I want to see, it's not just about increasing women around the table, it's getting a really diverse attendance at the table as well. And I think the initiatives I want to be looking at are are not just bringing more people in, but bringing people in from lots of different areas. I, I think it's really wonderful to be having conversations around increasing diversity in women in STEM. I think it's wonderful to be having conversations around increasing visibility amongst underrepresented communities, about neurodiversity, about disability. I think our table feels richer when we have a community of women who look like the community of the world around us here.